When I was in college, um, I had a classmate who um, had an illegal cable connection in his apartment and uh, he got very scared every time there were uh, police activities near his home he would think that he got caught and eventually he stopped stealing cable and he made a video about um, how if you if you steal cable you gotta worry about the cable theft police coming to your home uh, let me see if I can find that video but um, he uh, he scared himself to death. He eventually made a PSA about why not to steal cable. And um, in the video, uh, there are two guys sitting at home and an um, ambulance races by. And they're scared to death because they think it's the cable theft police coming after them. And uh, I had an issue where I, uh, it was unintentional, but I stole something and it, it scared me to death. Uh, what had happened was I was searching rolls of quarters and I had taken a ten dollar roll of quarters and I found two coins that were interesting and I took them out and I didn't have any quarters on hand to replace them with and I thought I'll just get to that later and I put the rest of the roll in my car and um, I was driving uh, across New York State and, uh, and absentmindedly I used the roll of quarters that was missing two quarters to pay a toll and uh, it wasn't until later that I realized my mistake and then a couple of days later on the return trip, oh, I get pulled over, and my heart starts pounding out of my chest. I'm thinking, oh my god, they've traced the roll of quarters that was missing 50 cents to uh, my license plate. And it turned out I just had a broken light, but I, my, my, my heart just pounded out of my chest. It made me realize that every time you do something wrong, oh, even if you get away with it, you're going to end up scaring yourself to death. Thanks for watching.